Welcome to the Children's Science Center. My name is Ashley, and I'm here to talk to you about my friends over here, the lionfish. So lionfish actually live all the way across the globe in the Indo-Pacific Ocean, but somehow they've made their way to the Atlantic Ocean and even all the way up to here in Virginia. And that's because they're something called an invasive species. An invasive species means that something has lived somewhere where it's not supposed to and is negatively impacting the ecosystem. So these guys, you can see, they're pretty big fish, right? They like to eat a lot. They're voracious hunters. They'll eat everything in sight. And that's actually a big problem in the Atlantic Ocean. We as people like to eat things like salmon, tuna, other types of fish that these guys will eat. So there's not enough for us and them to eat. How they came, became an invasive species is that people think just one or two people released them as pets. And they grew and grew and grew their population until there are a lot of them, and actually way too many of them. The females can lay two million eggs at once. That's how so many of them got here. Another reason why they're an invasive species and not just something that any old animal would eat or hunt or be a predator of is they have venomous spines. So do you see their spikes all the way along their back? They actually have 18 total throughout their body, and those can sting you. It's not deadly, but it is very, very dangerous to humans. Their flesh, however, is edible. So something we can do to help animals is actually eat lionfish. If you go to a restaurant and ask for lionfish, eventually, if enough people are asking, they might put lionfish on the menu, and there's something good for us to eat. How do we eat them, you ask, if they're venomous? Well, you must very carefully first remove the spines. Not only do they have their spines in the back, but you can see they have a sort of mane in the front. So that's why we call them lionfish. Personally, I think they look a little bit more like tigerfish with the stripes they have. But if you can guess, they can be pretty good at hiding in the ocean. They'll hide under a rock and jump out at their prey and surprise it. So that's what makes them really good hunters. You can see a couple of them are kind of coming up, looking at me through the glass. They have really good eyesight for fish, so it helps them find their food. Now these guys are really beautiful and they do belong someplace in the ocean, but not here. So remember, next time you go to a restaurant, let's ask for lionfish.